Yes guys, what's going on? It's Mex. Welcome back to Players World. Today we're here at Roll Hard Show at Vista Heritage. So let's go and have a look and see what cool shit we can find. Yes, so we're here with uh, Mexico. You Ford boys will be proud of me. I know what car this is. Escort Mexico. Let's whack some lyrical and let's go and have a look what else we can find in uh, the Roll Hard Show here at Vista Heritage. So we're here checking out this uh, 420 SEC, absolute killer in the black with the RSs dumped on air, I'm guessing. Gangster as hell. Absolutely love these. Two door bends, it's an absolute vibe. Uh, yeah, this is killer. Over here we've got a really cool white 202. Correct me if I'm wrong, but I'm pretty sure it's a 202. Um, it's got really cool engraving uh, on the lips and uh, on the trims it's uh, yeah killer car cool RS4 just rolling out on uh, right form splits pretty cool got an Integra just over here whole mix of cars here at Roll Hard a decked E36 some over fenders I'm just getting in the way of somebody's photo cool little 106 Tarmont's on splits, Survive, I haven't seen a set of those for years. Pretty cool, bonnet off, don't know what's going on here, but I'm sure it's pretty aggressive. Um, I don't even know what this is, Corvair, my bad. Patina, Gangster, Solid Wheels. These nuts are a vibe. Um, yeah, pretty cool look. Golf wagon going out just now. I love a golf wagon, even if it's a Mark V. Someone should tell him he's got no rear reg though before he drives out of the show. Yes, Sai, Ash, Hello, what's going on? My bad, how are you? Yeah, good, good. What are you saying? Nothing much, what are you saying? I'm not saying much. Obviously, make sure that you know this is a family show. How are you finding it today? Raining. Not anymore. Sunny days. It's all right then, isn't it? Brother, Brother weather with you? From sunny Manchester. Manny, Manny boy. Have you sold much today? Shit tons. Nobody wants these stickers. Yeah, top stickers. You had to walk around? Max, Jesus, no, I'm not, mate. No, I can't get involved in this. Wait, great, cut it, cut it, start it again. Yes, Max. What shoes you wearing? You tell me. It's got the cements on them, that. Got that. Well, nice, right? Don't worry about it. What shoes you got on? What shoes have I got on? Cements. Black cement freeze. I um, cleaned my trainers yesterday and then left them on my stairs. So I've got these battered ones out my fucking, out my car. I was like, shit, I have to swear to you. Yeah, I forgot it was a family show. So yeah, probably not going to use any of this, are we? <laughs> probably are you going for a run? Dirty wheels. What? What are you about? Clean them. They sort you out new wheels and then you don't even clean them. Yeah. Listen, clean Show us how you clean your wheels. You missed a bit. Come nowhere near me with that finger. That's what she said. <laughs> so we've got here a Honda pop-ups, probably a Civic, um, Nissan Godzilla, R34 V-Spec. That's really quite spicy. Tees, black tees is a vibe. Another R34, probably GTST or something. And then we've got here a Mini. Short wheelbase, mini, soft top, roof down cruising, perfect for the summer. Um, we've got our resident mini specialist, Steve, with us. Steve, can you talk us through this mini? It's been chopped up. Oh, it's not standard size? No, no, it's almost definitely chopped up. Oh, I thought it was short wheelbase. But it's, but it's not OE. <laughs> um, okay, so here you have it, ladies and gentlemen. Definitely custom, one of one, zebra, interior short no door hold on it's got no doors it's got no doors um so you probably gotta do a duke so hazard for you young guns out there just google it um in through the windows shame about the window sticker wagon 202 wagon 202 is that what it is no it's not it's an e it's a 124 wagon 123 then i can't count um, but it's 
an absolute vibe. BBS RSs, red caps, look legit as well, so vibe with that. Can't go wrong with the gold wagon. And some beats on the seats. Playboy mag on the dash. Player smokes, absolute vibe. Not sure about the blue insert on the grill, but everything else is on point, so we will forgive him for that. Someone's having a vibe check over there. GT40 is having a rev off as well. Not GT, no F40s, GT40s. Cool little white car, don't know what it is. Trying to be a Herbie with a 57 sticker on there. Oh, A35, so I'm told by the mini specialist. Mark II, got some trumpets and some RMs, fishnets. Oh, NSX with the three spokes, equips, can't go wrong, period correct. They look like a stagger, double stagger as well, so smaller wheel, bigger wheel, double width. Absolute vibe. We've got some colorful Porsches over here. Proper vibrant. And uh, Miami Blue, I think it is. 964 with a Fuchs. Is that how you say it? Correct me if I'm wrong. My German's not that great. Then another blue. Actually, that might be Miami Blue. But I think that Mark wants Miami Blue. Anyway. Yeah, so that's Miami Blue. Don't know what blue that is. Riviera, there we go. Marty with the safe. Yeah, so which one's legit? Mine's legit, and that's legit. That's VW Miami Blue, and that's Porsche Miami Blue. Alright, heard it here first. Two different Miami Blues. There's a difference. There's a difference. I thought they were all the same. Thanks for clearing it up. Um, so yeah, Miami Blue, Miami Blue. Oh wow, check this Mini out. We need our resident Miami um, Miami expert. We need our resident mini expert to step in and talk us through this. Steve, uh, was this mini? Talk to me. It looks quite spicy. It's a turbocharged A series, by the look of it. What does that mean to like non-mini people like me? So it's a standard mini engine with a turbocharger bolted to it. Oh right. Um, yeah, it looks quite spicy. Green block um, piping. Bolt on front end, is that the case? Yeah, so it's got a um, clubman, which is a square front end. Um, steering wheel quite far back. Looks like the seats sit past the A pillar, B pillar, sorry. So uh, probably a big lad drives this. Um, quite aggressive. Carbon bumpers. Weight saving. Um, yeah. I bet it's quite spicy. Quite a vibe. 190E, this was a player's uh, really cool caged rear, um, supercharged something inside, I think, apparently. Center locks. Um, this is killer. I love the color. It just works. DTM vibes all over the shop. Interior, super clean, super stripped. Yeah, big fan, big fan of this. So this Porsche Outlaw is absolutely mad. Trimmed frunk, trunk, whatever you want to call it. Um, hidden air install, really cool. Fuel cell right in the front. Yellow headlights, super smooth. Really, really cool green color. Um, interior looks like amazing. Really, really clean. I love this. I mean, I don't really know much about it, but yeah, really cool build. Outlaw car, outlaw shoes. Got a match. Yes. How you doing? How you doing? You alright? Yeah, good, mate. Yeah. yeah good, good. Um, is that? Is this yours? That is mine. Oh, really nice car, by Cheers, the way. Cheers, buddy. No worries. I, I mean, I don't really know much about it apart from it's really cool did you want to tell us a couple of bits for yeah, players tv it's, it's a replica 356 so it started life as a vw beetle 
it's on a 68 chassis body off new body on um, running running complete air ride 2.3 litre uh, flat four in the back free ray fly gearbox custom interior custom paint custom everything yeah, it looks. Uh, yeah, yeah, it, it looks it. Um, well, like I said, T. I don't know much, but it looks amazing. Like I think one of my favourite cars so far today. Cheers, brother. Yeah, no, it's uh, been building it for the last two and a half years. Okay, so yeah. I only finished it about four or five weeks ago. Nice. So, Has it been out much? Yeah, I drive it. I don't trailer it. Wicked. So we drove 100 miles here this morning, isn't it? Um, so yeah, it's built to be driven, not just uh, looked at. So. Wicked. Well, uh, thanks very much for talking to us about your car. No worries. Cool shoes to match. Can't go wrong. Thank you very much. Yeah. No Got yourself a little turb ski here on the Ruckus. Uh, quite aggressive. Then we've got um, pre-war inboard brakes. No outboard gearbox though this time. Back here with this dickhead. We live back with this dickhead. Um, so. Kaiser Sarek 7 looking much better in the silvery grey rather than that red, which, I mean, no one likes a red car. But yeah, well done, Kaiser, for the upgrade. And obviously the upgrade on the wheels, right forms. I think he lost his cap, someone should help him find them. If anybody sees Kaiser's caps, please report them back to Will Price in Essex. Another Ford. I think, you know what, I'm gonna step out of the Ford um, comments because I get them all wrong. There's probably another Mexico, but probably not. Jetta Coupe, I know about that. Small bumper, absolute touch, absolute touch. That's a bit of me there. Um, Impala, low rider. With a custom paint and pinstriping on the front and on the roof. Wire wheels with the knockoffs. One of my favorite cars for this weekend. Tom's 180 is sick. Tom's there just taking a towel out of the car. He probably didn't want to be filmed, but hi, Tom. Uh, tees, white tees, absolute killer. Uh, square setup, but with a rear stagger. 17s, 18s, suits the body so good. Not normally a fan of the silver cars, but this turned out absolutely amazing. I think the color works so good on it against the white TEs. Um, shame he's not got the bonnet up because the engine bay is an absolute dream of a job. Looks really good. Josh is like hell, 350, with his custom wide rear arches and front wings in a really nice, again, I think it's meant to be like a play on the Miami Blue. One of our favorite cars from Players Classic, this little Honda. They did tell me the name, but I've totally forgotten, but it's tiny, but we all loved it that weekend. So it's nice to see it here in a prime spot. Onto a Formula One car, actually real Formula One car. I don't know whose Formula One car it is, but it's legit one. Oh. Jesus, Schumacher's actually Formula One car. Powered by Ford, did not know that. Back from the Camel days, Benetton, Schumacher. This is cool, actually really cool. Didn't even know it was Schumacher, so really, really impressive. Um, just so you know, this Beetle is super cool. I won't read out what it says in the rear view mirror, wing mirror. Leave it up to you guys and Rick to show you on the camera. Cool little van over here and Healy. I think it's a Healy. Um, there's a dog inside the Healy. Dogs are a vibe, let alone dogs in cars. Yeah, double vibe. You all right, mate? You all right, mate? Safe. Yeah, cool. Cool dog. Cool car. So it's a used to be a front wheel drive auto JDM CRV. Okay. And now it's a four wheel drive manual boosted charge cord CRV. Okay, so quite a bit of uh, going on. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So I've done it all at home except the manifold 
and the turbo back exhaust. Uh, what made you um, think, you know what, let me go wild on a CRV? Uh, US, they're massive out there, US, they're massive, but UK, no one's really done anything. So I went, obviously my OZs, bigger wheels, bigger tires, and then, yeah, boost, just for fun. Oh. Just yeah, I'm, uh, yeah. Dad bus as well, because little, you know, little man. So of course. Yeah, you gotta, you got to be, you know, a bit grown up. That's it. So I did think there was something spicy about it when I saw Squared uh, Triple Eights. Triple Eights, yeah, yeah. So I tell everyone it's got a lot more power it has, but it has no. So it's still early stages. It's only half a bar of boost, but I'm going to up it over the winter to bar, hopefully get more than that, build the other engine I've got. So. Where well, you reckon it's running? Um, probably, roughly. roughly, maybe like 240, 250. I mean, that's plenty enough for a CRV. Yeah, yeah, exactly, yeah. So, I mean, factory is 130. So, okay, okay, yeah. So, so yeah, it's it's move. it still it's, moves. It is, yeah, still, hey, yeah, I'm happy with it and he's happy, so what can that's I do? That's all that matters, isn't it? Exactly, but wow. yeah, it's, it's pretty sick. Thanks so. for uh, talking to us about it, man. No Cheers. Yeah. yeah, no, for sure. Um, So, yeah, that's the story behind the CRV. Looks spicy, goes spicy. Much hotness. Here we've got a uh, Mazda FC3, absolute killer. I don't even mind it in the red. It is mad. Uh, NK wheels, bride on the inside, bride seat. Really nice, really tidy example. You don't really see these this tidy. Sits really nice. Super clean. Probably gonna get a bit of hate for this, but probably the best RX7 shape there is. Best looking body. I absolutely love it. So sick. Um, yeah, let us know what you think. FC, FD, Kaiser, don't like me. So, was this a Sierra? Yeah, yeah, it's just a 1990 Sierra hatchback, 1.8 LX, nothing overly special. Um, found it in Coventry. And uh, yeah, I got, I got pushed into it by my mates to get one. I've had three of them in the past. I used to just slam them, smash them off the floor, abuse them. And uh, yeah, I, I was toying with the idea of another one. They pushed me into it, went to see it. The guy had a ramp, so he was like, yeah, check it out. It's never been welded, all original paint other than the bonnet. Um, so yeah, then uh, just got it and thought, well, I always wanted to bag one. So yeah, went with the sort of 13s, like the old Ford sort of look. Give it a clean, got gloss house detailing to uh, do all the paint correction on it. And here we are. Nice, yeah. yeah. Um, I mean, peer pressure, sir. Uh, oh, it's yeah, a, it's it's a, a thing. wonderful thing. Yeah, 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 yeah. I, was, I went up there and I was like, it's not perfect. I'm not buying it. They'd be like, yeah, go on, it's, it's fine, just get it. So, yeah, I got, I got two litres e to go in it over winter, potentially. Maybe turbo, maybe throttle bodies, haven't decided yet. But, yeah, just keep it sort of original, but play with it a little bit. That's it. I mean, it looks, looks super clean. I know nothing about Fords, but I uh, like the small wheel look. The real louvres at the back. I don't know if that's a Ford thing. Yeah, I, I got lucky to find that. I've, I got the RS option spoiler, the louvre, the front lip, and the headlight covers. They were quite rare options, and the wing mirrors. I just got really lucky to find them. The wheels are really marmite. I get a lot of love hate comments online, which is fine. Yeah. I mean, <laughs> small wheels are like you have to say they're a bit of a yeah, yeah. hit I, and miss sometimes. I think I'm going to change them up. I might get some 15s, but the arches are really clean. Um, so I'm a bit skeptical about rolling them. And, Cutting them up a little bit, but I think I might have to do something with it at some point. But there's not a lot of wheel choices out there for Fords, you know, especially as opposed to the German stuff. But yeah, if I can find something, I'll, uh, I'll have a look. I think. That's it. We'll keep a we'll keep an eye out over Thanks winter and next summer. Then. Thanks for talking to us show. about it. Uh, yeah. play, players was the best show for me this year. Absolutely loved it. Really good show. So yeah, I'll definitely be back. Perfect. Thank you. Look forward to seeing you next year. Then. Thanks. Take care. See ya. Cheers. See ya. Uh, that does look quite tasty, but I'm okay. People Thank keep you. What you get on it. I think I'm Everything. Sure vegetables. I actually got. I actually got vegetable pizza, but everybody thinks I should have got meat. You should have got meat. Are you a vegan? No. Very, very tasty. Did they, uh... a... No, I'm okay. Thank you. That Those <laughs> mushrooms <laughs> don't look that cooked. Feel? Am I too close to that? No. I feel like it's quite a lot of money for quite a small pizza. <laughs> How much was it? £10.50. For a raw of, pizza? This bottle of BTEC Costco's water, £2.50. Um, yeah, I think that's quite a bit of money. Yeah. Will it be cheaper at Fitted? Yeah, it'll be a lot cheaper. <laughs> you heard it here first. Cheap pizzas at Fitted and donuts. Northern prices. Northern prices. Can buy a house for the price of that pizza. You could. <laughs> we have cows, we have sheep. We have lots of things like that up north. Farm like animals, all sorts. You'll see it all at Fitted UK. Sunday the 12th of September. Milo's an absolute vibe. Milo. Milo. Come back here immediately. 
very obedient. Very, very obedient. Very well trained. Like, northern dogs are like that. Yeah. Southern dogs are not very... Southern no. Just, My dog don't give a fuck. Yeah, no, just goes. Um, yeah, so let's go and uh, have you had a shot of that? Yeah, I wasn't very good. You didn't win? No, I didn't win. For some reason, I thought you'd be good at um, whatever the game that, drinking game that is. I purposefully lost because the prizes aren't very good. Um, on that note, let's... Um, Kobe! Oh. So close, that count as a win. Oh, I don't know. Oh, shame. So close. So that's it from Roll Hard at Mr. Heritage. They're just about to do the awards. Let us know what was your favorite car from all the ones we showed you. Thanks for watching and catch you next time.